Good afternoon. My name is John Michael Turner. I current re currently reside in Burlington, Vermont. I served with Kilo Company 3rd Battalion, 8th Marines as an automatic machine gunner. There's a term, uh, once a Marine, always a Marine, but there's also the term, eat the apple, F the core. I don't work for you no more. <laughs> when mistakes were made, we carried drop weapons. Please go to the next picture. These weapons right here were taken from the Iraqi police uh, back during our first deployment. And this is just an example that we would take their weapons and carry them around with us in case we did mess up and shot the wrong person. That is a man's face. On, on April 2nd, 2005 at Abu Ghraib, we had a very highly coordinated attack on us. And uh, the next day, we went ahead and had to uh, search the premises for any remains. Um, and obviously that face, or that part of the face was found and put on top of a Kevlar so could, a picture could be taken of it. This man right here was my third confirmed kill. As you can see, he was riding his bicycle. This, later on in the day, we went ahead and uh, we had CBS, Laura Logan with us, but she was with the other squad. And so she wasn't with us. So myself and two other people went ahead and took out some individuals because we were excited about the firefight we had just gotten into and we didn't have a cameraman or woman with us. With that being said, any time we did have embedded reporters with us, our actions would change drastically. We never acted the same. We were always on key with everything, played, did everything by the books. Though the man on the bicycle, he was left in the street for about 10 minutes until we realized that we needed to leave where we were. And his body was dragged about 10 feet to the right of him, where his body was thrown behind a rock wall and his bicycle was thrown on top of him. That was done on the uh, Ministry of Health building. This building was still in use. There were still people that went there. Um, and that was a missile that just went into it. This is um, after uh, one, of, one of the guys in uh, weapons company had gotten shot. Uh, this is a way that we would take out our aggression. For those of you who don't know, it is illegal to shoot into a mosque unless you were taking fire from it. There was no fire that was taken from that mosque. It was shot into because we were angry. With that being said, that is my testimony. I just want to say that I am sorry for the hate and destruction that I have inflicted on innocent people. And I'm sorry for the hate and destruction that others have inflicted on innocent people. And that until people hear about what is going on with this war, it will continue to happen and people will continue to die.